And finally, in North Africa, Libya's cattle breeders face a devastating blow as livestock diseases spread rapidly around the country. Farmers in the city of Misrata say that illnesses such as the lumpy disease have claimed the lives of more than 2,500 cows in just a year. And the lack of timely vaccinations for these animals has left them helpless, with huge financial losses and even bankruptcy. Our final report tells you more about Libya's crippling cattle industry. In the North African nation of Libya, things are not going well for the cattle breeding industry. This is especially in Misrata, the third largest city of Libya and the hub of its dairy production. According to several farm owners, their cattle often suffer illnesses such as foot and mouth disease and lumpy disease that have spread across the country in recent years. The foot and mouth disease, or the FMD, is a highly contagious viral infection that affects animals, including cows, pigs, sheep, goats and deer. If not treated on time, the infection can prove to be fatal for the livestock. Meanwhile, lumpy disease, as the name suggests, is a type of viral sickness in cattle where the animals have nodules on their skin, mucous membranes and internal organs. This disease could be fatal. These barns had 741 cows. Recently, we were exposed to foot and mouth disease and lumpy skin disease, which led to the death of more than 200 cows and 170 calves. Now the cows are suffering from high temperatures. The normal temperature for cows is supposed to be 36 or 37 degrees Celsius. Currently, the cow's temperature is between 40 and 41. This affects the milk production rate. These cows are considered to have no milk at all. Farmers in Libya say that while they try to keep their cattle safe and secure from these deadly diseases, the absence of timely vaccinations has claimed the lives of thousands of animals. And this number is only increasing, particularly due to the lumpy disease, which was identified for the first time in the North African country just last year. Breeders suffer from problems including foot and mouth disease and lumpy skin disease. Of course, foot and mouth disease is an endemic disease and unfortunately, in the absence of vaccination, the disease has spread in large quantities. Lumpy skin disease has also been introduced to us. This devastating disease has caused us very large losses, whether in the death of cows or a severe shortage of milk. The disease as Libyans know it, is a disease that we have recently learned about. It is a dangerous and destructive disease. This disease has completely destroyed our projects and caused more than 2,500 deaths of milk-producing cows. The lack of vaccination for cattle has also led to huge financial losses for the dairy industry in Misrata. And the scarcity of cows has prompted the price of these animals to go so high that many breeders face bankruptcy. As for the breeders, they have suffered huge losses and people have been harmed and have left the market. These losses are due to the lack of vaccination. The state has not cared about providing us with vaccination. The price of a cow is now expensive. A cow costs from 17,000 to 25,000 Libyan dinars or 3,550 to 5,220 US dollars. This means that when a breeder loses five or six cows, his project is over. After battling such fatal diseases, most of the cows produce little or no milk. This takes an extra financial toll on the farmers and adding to their hardships is the ongoing political and economic instability in Libya that has left them to suffer alone with very little hope for recovery. First Post decodes the U.S. election. Explains how America chooses its president. Your primer on the race to the White House. Everything you need to know about how America votes and its global implications. U.S. Election Explained. Every Monday and Thursday only on First Post.